in this video I am going to show you how to connect a form to the database. We have created form 2 which is student registration form and database 1. You can double click on database 1 and in the properties window you will see connection string. The value of connection string will be in front of it. You can double click it and highlight, right click on it, copy. Now you have copied connection string to your database. Now right click on anywhere in the form and select view code. In the top of coding, we can see so many using commands. They are library imports. Now we are going to import SQL library to our form. To do that, you have type using system.data.sql client and then semicolon. You have to put this line in your form where you use database connection. Then right after initialize component that means public method you have to write your connection you have to type sql connection con equals new sql connection and inside parenthesis you have to type at sign and double quotations if you have type it correctly it should show like this now you have already copied your connection to the database one now right click in the middle of double quotation and paste then you pasted your connection string but still there is an error to fix this error be carefully where the error starts it says the error starts here then what you have to do is to Select this double quotation and delete it. And again you have to move forward. Then check where the next error begins. Mostly it will be in database1.mbf and double quotation. Therefore you have to select that double quotation and carefully delete it. Then all your error messages will be gone. Now this is your connection to the database. SQL connection con equals new SQL connection at sign and the connection path to a database and there is no error. This is the way that you have to connect your database to your form. You should do these things to every form that you use with the database connection such as if you go to view designer in this registration form I am connecting my form to the database to add data search data update data delete data and refresh data refresh is used to get data from database and load this data grid view as you can understand I am doing data handling using this form therefore when I go to view code on the top this line should be included there is no difference and you should include this line as well this line should be added to each form that you are using with the database. Hope you understand how to connect database connection to your form.